chance of Yes We Can. Hundreds of people, some bust in from Racine and Madison, marching from Vosis de la Frontera on Milwaukee's south side to the county courthouse, speaking out against the president-elect. On January 20th begins the dream of Donald Trump. Let's make it his worst nightmare ever and start the 100 days of resistance. Concern over promises that have been made. We're building a wall. It's going to be a wall that is not, nobody's going through my wall. 16-year-old Fernanda Jimenez goes to Horlick High School. She's worried about being deported and says it was necessary to join the march. We can't lose hope. We have to have hope. If we lose hope, there's no victory. We have to keep fighting. Vosis Executive Director Christine Newman-Ortiz says keeping families together is a major focus. Strategies are being implemented to create defense networks to stop mass deportations and to affirm a community that's united and values the diversity. The people have power and if we're, since we're all together it just it turns into a powerful alliance that we can beat anything. Group leaders say they want Milwaukee to be a sanctuary for immigrants and their families. They're also currently planning more events. In downtown Milwaukee, Ben Hutchison, WISN 12 News.